Hello everyone and welcome back to another Six Senda update. This is week nine and I'm really excited to get into today's video. It was a very interesting week. It was Thanksgiving this week. So yeah, I have a lot to say. We're gonna go over the dosage, the side effects, how the week went, my progress and all of that stuff. And if you guys wanna see progress photos, I actually share those over on Instagram. I have a highlight that is, I think it's not named Sex Senda, but I need to switch it so that it says Sex Senda as the highlight. And I've been sharing pretty much uh, my progress and just kind of like my experience taking the medication. So if you wanna follow me over there, you can see that as well. And yeah, let's just go ahead and get into today's video. So this was a really interesting week just because like I said, it was Thanksgiving. My new weeks start on Fridays. So I remember I did my check-in and um, which was great. And then Saturday I actually dropped even more weight, which was really exciting. And I actually shared that over on Instagram and a progress photo. Pretty much every Saturday is when I'll do a picture over there. So I was really excited about that. And then the week came <laughs> and we actually were staying at home for Thanksgiving this week. And since it was just us and my family, I had a lot of dishes that I wanted to make and I didn't want to like hold back on eating Thanksgiving food or anything like that. So I actually started making the dishes on like Monday and I was make making like a dish each day so that on Thanksgiving, I didn't have like a whole bunch to cook all by myself. And yeah, it definitely was a little bit of a roller coaster this week. It was actually really interesting to eat kind of whatever for ex an extended period of time just to see how it would go on the medication. So I kind of took it as a little bit of an experiment and a little bit experiments, experiment and kind of some lessons in there as well. So before I get into the actual week, I wanted to share the side effects this week. I am still at the three milligram dose, which is the highest dose. It's been many weeks now. Again, I feel like it's working so well now that I've been at this dosage for many weeks. Works so much better than when I was upping my dosage and all that. I remember at one point when I was like at 1.8, like I felt like my hunger was coming back and I was really like nervous and afraid that maybe this wasn't gonna work for me. But since being at the three milligram dose now for over a month, it's working better and better each week, I feel like. Or I wouldn't say it's working better and better each week. I feel like it's been working really well for an extended period of weeks now that I've been at the max dose because the max dose is where you are supposed to get to. Like, that is the dosage for you to lose weight on this medication. It's just you have to work your way up to it because of the side effects. So with that being said, side effects really weren't that bad. Now I will say this last week, I had my first postpartum period, TMI, sorry for the guys watching. So I had that on top of everything else, which was interesting. I definitely could feel my body was totally out of whack and bloated and yeah. So I had that also going on this week, which was kind of like a double whammy plus Thanksgiving. Um, so it was definitely interesting for sure. But besides that, my fatigue really has been good. Like I haven't been having the issues like I did in the beginning. I remember it was so hard in the beginning. I could not work out hardly. I was on the couch. I was taking naps. Like I was just dead. And I feel like now that I've been at the three milligram dose for many weeks now, like it's just in my system and it's just working better than ever. And I almost feel like normal. Like I feel back to normal. So let's get into the week because this is really where it got interesting. So since starting this medication, I have really tried to limit my carbs and my sugar. I'm not keto by any means, but I do like tend to pick things that are lower in carbs. Now I'm not perfect at all. Like I still eat fast food here and there on the weekends. We eat out um, and I get whatever. I don't really like drink soda anymore. Just like certain foods on this medication and drinks like soda just don't taste that great to me. I definitely have had that balance through this whole nine weeks. It hasn't just been full on dieting and it hasn't been a full on like chaos. Like I've been in the middle because it's really important to me to learn the balance of everything and not just be on a strict diet and not just eat whatever I want. Like it's coming in the middle. And that's what this medication has really helped me do. It's helped me with the sugar cravings, with overeating and really choose things that make me feel good and my body feel good. Cause after this Thanksgiving week, you guys, of all the Thanksgiving food, I felt so bad. So since I really wasn't eating heavy carbs and then all of a sudden I was eating a lot of stuffing and green bean casserole, mashed potatoes, gravy, I made a strawberry cake and so lots of sugar and just all kinds of things that I just wasn't eating for the past few weeks. 
whoa, my weight was like all over the place. It was crazy. And of course, when you spend a day eating like way more um, than you normally would, like your weight is going to fluctuate, but it doesn't mean it's all like fat. Um, but it definitely was all over the place this week. And the great thing about it was that I was definitely still like very small portions. Like, although I was eating cake, I like had like a little square, I would maybe eat like half of the square that was like this big. And same with my Thanksgiving plate. You know, when you get your Thanksgiving food, you get like all the stuff. Like I ate maybe like half of each serving, like, and normally I would eat it all kind of thing. So it was definitely still working, um, but I could feel myself feeling so lethargic and drained and even moody over the past week because of how heavy the carb load was. Like my body was just struggling and it just didn't feel good at all. So it's kind of funny, it's not really funny, but it's kind of funny that my weigh-in is every Friday, which was literally after Thanksgiving. So I'm like checking my weight for week nine and it's literally the day after Thanksgiving. So uh, with that being said, my progress this week, I started at 164.2 and on Friday I was 164.4. So I gained two, two ounces, um, which to me, it's not really that way. It's the fact that I ate a lot more heavier the day before and the couple days before prior. So obviously my weight wasn't going to be less this week. And I kind of went into this week knowing like, it's probably not going to be like a weight loss week, which is fine. You know, not every single week, especially around the holidays. I don't think it's good for us to put the pressure on ourselves to you know, try to continuously lose as much weight as possible, which if that's your whole vibe and your journey, like that's cool. But for me, it's just not realistic. And I didn't want to feel like I couldn't eat things, you know, with everyone else. So with that being said, I'm currently on week 10, it's Tuesday. And so like now from Friday to Tuesday, I'm so excited, like just going right back to how I was eating and the progress it's already making. I'm so excited for next week's update just to kind of show you guys like you can have the balance. Like you don't have to be way over here. And of course you don't really wanna be way over here. There's a middle ground and this medication has been so amazing at helping me really decipher what is good for me, what feels good to me, and also how I can still lose weight and still enjoy food and not be so fixated on it. So that is it for today's sex end update. I didn't lose any weight this week, Thanksgiving. So I'm curious how, you know, the next few weeks are before Christmas, but I will be updating you guys. Definitely make sure you are subscribed if you wanna keep up with the updates and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.